Hello guys, welcome to the next video on Linux command line tutorial for beginners. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use watch command in Linux. Watch is an excellent command which can run scripts or command at a regular interval or repeatedly. So for example, I'm going to give you an example which I have taken in the last video and uh, we have used this free command to know the resources used in our system, right? And if you use a watch command, so any command which you use with watch, so I'm going to just write watch before this command, then this command will be executed repeatedly if you use watch before uh, any command, right? So let's uh, just press enter. And you can see after every two seconds, this command is going to be executed and you can see uh, the resources used will be changed after two seconds. You can see it's changed, right? So by default, uh, the command will be executed at an interval of two seconds, right? Now, if you want to make it faster, we can do it. Just uh, press Control C to come out of uh, this command. So just press console, Control C and you will come out of this command. Now, for example, uh, we want to increase the frequency to execute this command. You can use the flag N and then the number of seconds which you want to provide. So earlier by default, it was two. For example, I want to use one second interval. So I can just write minus M space one and it's going to ex be executed at an interval of one second. So I'm going to press enter once again. And now it's, uh, you know, refreshing at a one second interval okay now uh, even i can uh, you know increase this frequency in points also so what we can do is i'm going to con press control c once again and instead of one second for example i want to uh, execute this command at an interval of 4.5 second i can just do it by just writing 0.5 here and press enter and it's going to be executed at 0.5 second you can see every 0.5 second okay so this is how you can use watch command so you can use uh, this watch command with any command or even with the script it's going to execute that script uh, repeatedly okay so in the last video we have also seen uh, the df command which is disk free command right so we can also use uh, this disk free command you can just write df and then press enter and it's going to uh, you know execute this command repeatedly right now nothing is happening here because we are not downloading or uploading anything on our system or from our system for example if you download a big file you will be able to see the used memory and available memory changing so you can use it uh, as a you know watch to watch uh, what kind of memory is used or you can you know think of any command which can be used repeatedly and you can use uh, this command with uh, that command or script okay so i hope you've enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now